What's up guys? I was uh, getting ready to put in this new buffer spring on this rifle that I just finished up and just was thinking about it for a little bit and I know there's probably a lot of you guys out there that already know this but one thing that drives me crazy on AR-15s is a noisy ass buffer spring. You guys know what I'm talking about. Whenever it cycles back to pick up the next round it sounds like I don't know nails on a chalkboard rattly old pop cans whatever the heck you want to call it but it sounds horrible that's all it is so one thing i want to show you guys and a lot of you guys already know this but take just a little bit of your gun oil and lube up the spring it makes a huge difference just try it on yours if you guys are having any trouble or you might not even realize it you might just be used to the noise take a little bit of oil put it on that buffer spring doesn't take much at all get you any type of rag just kind of you don't want to dry it all up but you want to get some of the excess off of it doesn't take much I just usually do two little rounds on it just needs a little, little bead all the way down rotate bead it up again wipe the beads off just a little bit and then make sure it's coated all over the spring itself then you're going to put it back in the rifle and I guarantee you you guys are going to notice a world of difference then after you get your buffer spring and your buffer back in there just like your bolt carrier you just want to cycle it through a little bit that way that oil is lubricating the inside and you're good to go to follow up on that I highly recommend these custom buffer springs from JP. Uh, this is JP Rifles, JP Enterprises. Uh, my 6.5 Grendel's got a lot of their components on it, but I highly recommend these custom buffer springs. But if you have a regular buffer spring, those are fine as well. Um, you're gonna notice a little bit of a difference with these, but if you're having any noise issues, uh, you might not even realize that you're having noise issues. Take you a little bit of gun oil, slap it on that buffer spring and let me know what you guys think also have another little trick to keep the wobble the play between your upper receiver and your lower receiver to a minimum on these ar-15s i'll throw a card up here on that you guys can check that out but as always appreciate you guys being here happy hunting be safe we'll see you bye